Everyone, we are live in Provo and taking your calls. I want to go back to Alexis Summers. Alexis, uh, you gave your testimony on the stand and we were riveted. I mean, mm -hmm. I felt that I already knew you and had studied so much about the case, but what was it like when you finally were in the witness chair and you were looking at the jury? That's a lot different than just talking to me over the airwaves or or talking to the prosecutors. What was it like when you were finally up there and, and trying to tell them what happened? You know, I was just trying to be honest and remember everything the best I could. Um, it was very, very nerve wracking because I wanted, I wanted to tell the truth and I wanted the jury to be able to understand my testimony and, and believe what I had to say. Um, you know, I was looking at these people that were going to be deciding this fate and I was just uh, so concerned and, and, and hoping that, that they, would, they would see my testimony for what it was and be able to mm -hmm. convict my father. Alexis, I know this is going to be a hard question, but what moment in time, if there is that defining moment, that you realized or first suspected that your father murdered your mother? Um, it was as I was driving to the airport and uh, I, I was talking and, and um, you know, I'd just been told that my mother's in the bathtub and to come home and I dropped everything. I got in my car and I just started screaming, he killed her, he killed her. Um, I, I just knew, I knew right away that he had done that. My mother had told me, if anything happens to her, make sure it wasn't my father. And I knew it was him. That last day, Alexis Summers, that you saw your mother, did you have any feeling of foreboding at all when you left to go back to medical school? No, I didn't. I mean, she was doing really well. I wouldn't have left if she hadn't been doing well. You know, I just remember hugging her and giving her a kiss and, and, and walking into the airport. And, you know, I definitely couldn't imagine or dream what would happen, you know, just a few Alexis, hours later. Alexis, I, I can still remember the very last moment that I saw my fiance before he was murdered. He was driving away, I was waving, and he held his arm out the window and kept driving. Mm -hmm. Do you remember the last moment that you looked back and you saw your mom before you said goodbye? I, I vividly remember it. Um, I was walking into the airport and I, I turned and I waved and I smiled and she smiled at me.